Hey everybody, Louis Skibo here from Power Mods. You know, I'm just about done this rev, but I gotta get those handlebars up nice and high. I'm a tall guy, I'm 6'1". I don't like leaning down when I'm riding my sled. I wanna be up nice and high, I wanna be able to stand and have some fun. Now today I'm gonna install these Rock Speed FX adjustable risers. These are four and a half to six and a half inch rise. Now these are gonna be pretty handy because I can raise them and lower them. So if I wanna just lower the bars at the end of the day, have a nice comfortable sit down on the ride out of the trail, I'll just lower them with that. I can easily get home comfortably. Now to install them on the rev, I have this little pivot here. So we're gonna get this installed today and I'll show you how I'm gonna do it. When you order these adjustable risers from firstplaceparts.com, you're gonna need this little pivot here. And this is a very simple install. It's gonna allow you to raise and pivot the bars up a little bit more forward, which is kind of what you want. Now I know this is a rider forward chassis, one of the first ones, pretty much the first one to come out. Pretty innovative at the time, 2003. And now they made a big difference for the riders. How long you could go sit on a sled, what you could do with them. This I'm gonna tighten up. I just set that about in the middle, equidistant more or less than side to side. Now these Rock Speed FX adjustable risers are pretty handy. They fit the stock 7 8 bar, but they also have these little aluminum inserts that you can just pop out. Just take a little screwdriver, wedge them out, and they'll accept up to an inch and an eighth bar, which is what I'm using on here. This bar is off a free ride. I like it. It's aluminum, 6061. It's pretty tight, pretty strong. So all you do is you Leave the 7 8 fittings on the bottom. Slide your adjustable risers on. Just keep them loose. Keep everything loose until the very end. That way you can align everything easily. I'm just going to fit up my bar. I'm just going to lightly snug these up in place here. There are little alignment marks on the bars themselves, so you're going to want to make sure that they're kind of in the middle. Just tighten up the bottoms, make sure they're about equidistant as well. You just want to make sure that these are aligned or not askew, as some may say. You want to make sure that these are good and tight. Nothing worse than landing off a little jump and having your bars twist on you. All I do now, because I can't get underneath to tighten these bottom Allen headed bolts, Loosen these up. I just twist this up to where I want it. Tighten these up. There we go. I'm just going to loosen these off. Look at that. Let's tighten up my Retaining bolts. And that's it. I'm going to love these adjustable risers. I know it. I've driven with them before on Keeley's sled and they work just great. 
So I got to thank you guys for coming. When you go to order these, make sure you give firstplaceparts.com a call. Tell them Louie from Power Mod sent you. Check us both out on Facebook and on YouTube. And give me a big old thumbs up on these YouTube videos. I got to thank you guys for coming. Come again. I'm Louis Skibo.